Cindy, and we're gonna be baking up some cakes with great taste. Hi everyone. I decided to make a little something that I thought the kids might enjoy for a New Year's Eve treat. And I am going to be making homemade muffins, something I've never done before. So you get to try it with me for the first time. I'm starting with a fourth a cup of butter and a third a cup of sugar. And I'm just going to cream those together in my bowl to start with. And after I get that done, then I will add the other ingredients. In case you wonder what creaming your butter is, it's simply just smashing the butter and the sugar together until they become one. You do want to start with some room temperature butter, otherwise it won't work very well. Okay, now I'm going to add one large egg. And I'm going to mix that up. Make sure you mix your egg in really well. I don't think it requires an electric mixer. You can do all of this by hand, I believe. Now I'm going to add my dry ingredients after I have mixed up my eggs and my sugar and my butter. And I'm adding two and one third cups of all purpose flour, one teaspoon of salt. That was actually supposed to be one half teaspoon salt, so let's hope that my mixture is not too salty. And then I need one cup of whole milk. And I forgot the baking powder. I need four teaspoons of baking powder. Grab the back of a knife and scrape off any excess to make your, your measurements accurate. One, two, three, four. So now we have our egg, our butter, our, our flour, our baking powder, our salt, our milk, and now we need a teaspoon of vanilla extract. And one and one half cups of blueberries. Seems a little thicker than what I expected it to. I don't know if it's because it's nothing mixture or what, I'm used to cakes. After I get all that mixed up, then I will be adding the blueberries. I suppose you could use any other item in there you want to. You probably could use chocolate chips or whatever. But in this batch, I'm using the blueberries. So gently fold them in. I think I'm not being too very gentle. Hopefully that won't matter. But the mixture is kind of thick, so it's kind of hard to get in there. Okay, I'm going to have my muffin tins already right here. And I'm going to use my ice cream scoop so I can get close to the same amount in each muffin tin. Each have one good scoop. And then I'm going to go back and add another scoop because I, well, probably another half a scoop because I hear they're supposed to be at least halfway full. Now let's make the topping for the muffins. Yum, that's probably the best part. It calls for one half cup sugar, one third a cup of flour, a half teaspoon of cinnamon, and a fourth a cup of cold butter. Just to cube the butter, just so it will mix better. And after you get all this mixed up, then you sprinkle it over top of the muffins. Okay, here's my topping. I have my topping mixture that I just sprinkle over top. They're ready for the oven. And cook about 20 to 25 minutes. Muffins were so good. If you enjoyed the video, hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. See you in the next video.